So if you're going to be flying out of Austin today, you'll notice some changes to how you park. Austin Bergstrom International Airport brought some, bought some new equipment. Online last week, it caused delays for some travelers. One woman tweeted it took her husband 40 minutes to leave the garage. Yikes. Chris Davis joins us now. Chris, airport officials say those problems, they should be fixed, especially as a lot of people are heading out for Christmas Eve and Christmas Day. Yeah, so no real issues uh, reported in the last few days. And ABIA expected about 26,000 people to fly out of here just yesterday alone. And you can see the airport is humming right along again here this morning. These new parking systems aim to make this whole process easier on everyone who flies out of here. If you only travel during the holidays, there's a lot of things you may not recognize between this year and last year. Among them, these big electronic signs and this new garage entrance. The machines that give you your ticket are all new, too, and that switch caused those delays. One of the main reasons we saw that uh, was primarily travelers who had come through, parked at the garage on the old system, and came back through on the new system. ABIA says there will be fewer hiccups as more people start using the new system, but the changes don't stop here. The first two levels of this garage opened last Christmas. There are three more levels open this year, and these lights help travelers find spots faster. Cameras are trained on spaces, so if you see a green light, it means there's a spot free. Plus, those cameras can help you find your car when you land back in Austin. You come back, can't remember where you parked, you can actually uh, go to a kiosk, look up your license plate, and it'll show you exactly where your spot is in the garage. The final floor of the garage should open next year. It'll accommodate 6,000 cars in all as the airport continues to see major growth in the number of passengers. Yeah, and all that new ticketing equipment that they have installed, ABIA says, all of that is going to make the payment process uh, easier, faster, and really speed up the traffic flow uh, through the airport as well. We'll send it back to you. All right, thank you, Chris. I like the idea of it looking up your license plate to help you remember where you parked your car. So ABIA is expecting major growth. 31 million passengers are expected by the year 2037. That's why parking changes are one of the airport's priorities. It's part of its master plan to help accommodate all of those people.